Elon Musk's company Tesla has the mission to accelerate the world's transition to sustainable energy. Are you on board? Hi everyone, my name is David and welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be breaking down Tesla, one of the hottest stocks in recent memory over the past few years and that could potentially generate huge investment returns. Please note that my investment thesis focuses on investing in companies that are causing disruptive innovation and I typically invest in solid companies with a 5 year horizon. Please keep in mind that this stock breakdown is solely based on my own personal opinions, preferences and research. I am in no way shape or form trying to persuade you guys into putting your money into Tesla. You will be investing at your own risk. Please perform your own due diligence and research before making any sort of investment decisions. Let's get right into it. Tesla is a company that most of us are all familiar with, typically known for being an electric vehicle and a clean energy company. Its stock price surged 700% in 2020, went through a 5 for 1 stock split, and is currently trading at around $719 per share. Tesla also experienced a 20% revenue growth in 2020. The first aspect that I will dive into are the industry breakdowns and growth opportunities. Electric vehicles are quickly becoming the future of the automotive industry, with its enormous growth potential. Currently, on a global scale, electric vehicles only account for 2.2% of the overall global vehicle market share. EVs are estimated to go from 2.2 million units in sales in 2020 to 40 million units in sales in 2025. The company that is leading the charge is Tesla. However, China is the largest automobile market worldwide, both in terms of supply and demand, and account for the largest share of global EV sales. Therefore, it could hold the secret to the next big winners in this space. Tesla is the number one brand in China and was the first foreign car maker permitted to open a factory in China. Tesla, in my eyes, is more of a data company, having accumulated more than 30 billion miles of real-world driving data, and no other company even comes remotely close. The probability of success in autonomous is going up, and the autonomous vehicle market is projected to surpass upwards of $65 billion by 2027. Tesla's autonomous strategy and artificial intelligence expertise are key to becoming winners in this space. In the AI world, the company that has the most data and best quality data will win. There are other opportunities like the ride-sharing market, which is valued at around $70 billion in 2020 and could potentially be a more profitable business than EV and could help limit a certain level of risk. Finally, there is the clean energy piece, Tesla's mission to accelerate the world's transition to sustainable energy. As climate change is reaching alarming levels and can have devastating and irreversible effects on our planet and on future generations to come. The world needs to and is becoming more environmentally conscious, and I believe that the next trillion dollar company should be revolutionary in driving this change, and Tesla could be the one. The second aspect is Tesla's team, which consists of Elon Musk, who is the co-founder, CEO, director, product architect, and unquestionably the primary driving force of Tesla. Alongside a great leadership team in Zachary Kirkhorn, Andrew Baglino, Jerome Greeland, and several others. With Elon Musk at the helm leading the way and his transformational staff always believing that there is a better way to do everything and focusing on constant improvement, this has shaped an innovative culture at Tesla. One of the most remarkable things about Elon is his ability to break down and communicate his big ideas in a series of tangible steps while uniting his team around his vision and objectives. With that said, I have full confidence in Elon's leadership in continuing to grow and take Tesla to the next level. The third aspect are Tesla's products. Tesla has become one of the world's greatest innovators and this is reflected across its product line, from its fleet of electric vehicles to battery energy storage from home to grid scale, solar roofs, solar panels are all known for their standard of excellence. Let's take Tesla's electric cars for example. It introduced a new hardware and software architecture where it is integrated around a single central software architecture which enables Tesla's ability to collect and measure data, update software, and optimize its vehicle performance. Tesla's hardware architecture includes a flat pack of batteries at the base, two electric engines at the front and rear, no transmission, and so forth which provides it with competitive advantages like having more efficient battery management, a lower center of gravity, and greater energy density. Tesla also has an entire set of complements needed for a consumer to use its product. This is why Tesla has built up a charging network which allows its consumers to drive long distances because there is an infrastructure in place for them to charge their vehicles. The final aspect is Tesla's financials, which I will quickly brush over. Note that these are approximated numbers based on data from September 2020 where Tesla had a debt of $12.1 billion and holds $14.5 billion in cash, 
which leaves it with $2.2 billion in net cash. It also has a free cash flow of $1.8 billion, which is 144% of its EBIT, which is earnings before interest and taxes. Tesla's total assets amounts to $52.1 billion with a total assets growth of 52%, and its total liabilities is $28.4 billion. Overall, Tesla has a rock solid, healthy balance sheet. And there you have it. In my opinion, Tesla is a great and innovative company that I just broke down and could potentially be a big winner in the stock market. Now, as always, if you've enjoyed this video and felt that it gave you a lot of value, please support the channel by subscribing and smash the like button for the YouTube algorithm. I will see you in the next one.